So guys, this is the uh, prototype DC uh, antenna rotator uh, developed by uh, View 2 JXM and View 3 JYO. This is the first prototype for testing for portable operations. But also this uh, motor's torque is equivalent to the uh, GXE 1000. It can also be used uh, in your uh, home shack to drive uh, much bigger antennas, much heavier antennas and masts. So this is the first prototype for my portal and field activities which I have uh, requested uh, you to JXM and view 3 JYO, JYU Jagan and uh, it's uh, developed and uh, probably getting into uh, commercial production now guys information for you uh, exciting days ahead it comes with a very nice uh, software interface where you can set to north and uh, you can correct it to one degree tolerance on this it's a wonderful piece of uh, hardware and software combined this is the controller box the software developed and uh, the radiator which you see on top here uh, this is using right now only about point, uh, 200 milliamps and about 3 watts of consumption just for your information guys great eyeball with both of them we will be posting their pictures soon to, uh, view 2 JFM uh, Jashan uh, I need to tape this uh, all so I can uh, Repeat what I told you uh, for the video. I don't want to post it with the wrong call sign. So I'm uh, using a portable mast uh, at a height of about uh, 18 feet and uh, 9 feet, uh, 10 feet long boom with uh, four whips, collapsible whips, which are tuned right now to 10 meters. Uh, with this uh, building right next to it and on my uh, home balcony, I'm able to achieve an SWR of 1 is to 1.5, which I'm sure will uh, really improve when I take it outdoors. And uh, there's a DC motor on test prototype made by view 2 jxm and view 3 jyu uh, Juliet Yankee uniform. This is a, a 12 volts uh, DC portable motor, but it has the torque to uh, match the uh, GXC 1000 Yezu motor, and it can also run. Uh, big antennas of uh, 40 to 50 kilos and the mast it can easily handle and uh, it consumes only about 200 millivolts and uh, about 3 watts in power uh, gestion so this is what I wanted to test actually and uh, very happy to have a portable rotatable uh, motor rotator of working on DC I had an AC one before this and was causing a lot of QRM because I was using AC power supply and difficult to carry an AC power pack everywhere. This works on 12 volts. And uh, like I said, uh, with my attenuator off and IPO off, uh, PM off, we are 55 to 57 on the uh, uh, S meter. And uh, with my preamp on to preamp one, uh, you're coming up to almost uh, 59, uh, 59 plus 5 uh, with this setup, Jashan. Over to you, View 3 Juliet Fox Cut Mike, View 2 Uniform Charlie Romeo. <laughs> this uh, just a correction on my uh, portable mast also it's a telescopic mast uh, which uh, fully extended goes to about 18 feet uh, right now it's at about uh, 15 feet height on my balcony and I'm using a 10 foot uh, boom with uh, four whips on it uh, tuned to 10 meters and right now the radio I'm using is a FT Foxtrot Tango 710 with about 90 watts of power I'm pushing and my QRP radios are 705 and I have a true USDX and I also have the red uh, corner uh, QRP radio for 8 bands but my favorite is the DL2 man radio which uh, 3 to 4 watts I am able to break through if 
I am in an outdoor area out of Bangalore. Uh, in Bangalore, there's too much PRM and uh, sometimes I do get through, but uh, it's a little difficult with the uh, noise floor uh, suggestion. VU3 Juliet Foxtrot Mike, VU2 Uniform Charlie Romeo, over to you. Okay, Raja Hari. For the power, do you hook it up to your car battery or do you have like a LiPo or some other battery pack? Uh, because I'm also trying to work on a portable setup. Uh, I got my antenna, the vertical antenna, uh, target for the 40 to 6. And uh, for the radio, I think I will just use the 7300 for now. I know